Namaste. Welcome to my prenatal video for the beginning of a yoga class. We'll start out with the warming and centering portion of it. So I have a chair just to sit on. If you wouldn't join me on a chair, make sure it's not too squishy, just nice and solid and supportive. I like to start on the chair just because it's nice to have a little extra support sometimes and it's good to be kind to yourself. So have a seat, close your eyes and just become present. Let your breathing be natural and just take a moment to thank yourself for creating this opportunity to focus on yourself and your well-being. It's so important just to take the time out from the world and from everything that's going on and just focus inside for a few moments. Place a hand over your heart and a hand on your belly and let the breaths deepen. Nice deep breaths in and deep breaths out. You don't want to retain the breath, just lengthen the inhales, lengthen the exhales, breathing freely. Feel the connection between your heart and your belly as your breath goes in and the breath goes out. The connection between the heart and the baby is already beginning, it's already deepening. And with every breath, we're adding nourishing oxygen to that connection. Breathe in deep and exhale. Always come back to the breath. Remember this for delivery time. Remember this for postpartum time. Nice deep breaths in and out. Okay, you can open your eyes, relax the hands. Let's sit forward on the edge of our chair just a little bit and widen our stance. We want to have like a nice wide legged position here. The spine is still long, the shoulders are over hips. And one more time, let's close our eyes and do a little more breathing. Place your palms firmly on your thighs. Again, just building that connection, that steadiness here and go within. And as you inhale, Let's do some Kegels. Contract all the pelvic floor muscles and as you exhale, relax. Inhale, contract. Exhale, relax. These Kegels will serve you well, not only during your delivery, but for many years after. Relax. Inhale, contract. Exhale, relax. One more. Inhale, contract. And exhale, relax. Okay, open your eyes, take your hands out to your side. Let's stretch your arms, inhale up. And exhale, lean forward. Let the belly hang between the thighs. Keep the spine long. We're not folding too deeply. Keep the spine in the cervical neck neutral. And just breathe in and out, letting the belly hang. Inhale up. Release the arms. Again, inhale the arms up, look up, and extend forward. Let the belly hang. Just reach a little bit as we deepen our breaths, inhaling and exhaling. Inhale the arms up, arms out to the side. Let's stretch your right leg out. Place your left palm face up on your knee, and we'll be receptive in this pose. Arm up and over as we breathe in. Keep both sides of the ribs long so you can fill both lungs with air and release. Bend that knee, straighten the left leg. Take your right palm, flip it up, feel the receptive power from that move. Arm up and over as we breathe in. Expanding both lungs, look up if it's comfortable. Breathe in deep and exhale. Keep your legs spread wide, both knees bent. We're gonna hold the belly, keep the hands pointing forward. We're gonna do a twist, but not for the lower spine or the belly. You're gonna look over your right shoulder, back to center. Over your left shoulder, back to center. We'll do a little bit deeper, but you're still not gonna twist the lower part of the spine or the belly. Look over your right shoulder, and if you really want a little bit deeper feeling, kind of tip your shoulders. Take your right shoulder blade down the back. 
slight deep, but you're not really twisting any place that's dangerous, keeping it all in the upper part of the chest. Back to center, look over the left shoulder. Again, if you feel that need to go deeper, just tuck your left shoulder blade down a little bit, keeping the belly front and center and release. Take the feet back to center, arms up, breathe in, palms touch, down to the heart. Namaste.